Okay, during this drawing activity, we're going to be completing the trammel toy drawing. And as you can see here, this is an example of the trammel toy in action. Um, created a visual description of it here uh, with motion, an animated type uh, drawing. Um, what we're going to do first is begin by drawing the different screws. There's three different screws that we're going to be completing first during this video. They are the knob socket head cap screw, the base socket head cap screw, and the arm socket head cap screw. Okay, during the knob socket head, head cap screw, we're going to start out with the 2D sketch. And uh, we want to draw this on the XY plane. And we're going to draw this uh, with the line command. And we're going to draw half of the profile of the screw and then revolve it. Okay, we want to choose the line command. And we're going to start here at the point of origin. We're going to draw a line vertically, 90 degrees. Uh, to a dimension of 0.841 and enter and then we're going to draw a line uh, to the right at 90 degrees a distance of 0.324 this is the overall diameter of the head of the screw so we're going to divide that by 2 so 0.324 divided by 2 and enter. And then we're going to go down 90 degrees to a distance of 0.216. So that kind of gives us the profile of the head of the screw. And now we're going to go inward. I don't have a specified distance here. We're just going to go in maybe about halfway and click. And then we're going to go down the rest of the way to so we're in line with the uh, point of origin and click and then back to the point of origin. Okay, next we want to dimension. We're going to dimension this bottom part of the screw and this dimension should read 0 .108. 0 .108. Okay. So next, we're ready to revolve this, so we're going to finish the sketch. And we're going to go up here to the menu and select Revolve. And we want to select the Revolve Axis. Revolve Axis will be this line right here. This will be the center of the screw. And then I simply select OK. Okay, next we're going to draw a polygon. And we want it to be six sides. And I'm going to click here on the point of origin and drag out my polygon. And click somewhere around here. It doesn't matter how big it is right now because we're going, going to dimension it. So after I draw it, I select Done and then select Dimension. And we're just going to simply put a dimension across here. And we want this dimension to read 0.15625. Okay, next we're going to finish the sketch. And we're going to extrude this uh, polygon. We want it to go inward 0.1. Okay, next we're going to put threads on the screw. To do that, we're going to go up here to the toolbar, it might say hole or threads up here. I'm going to click on this tab and select threads. Next, I want to define the specifications. The threads for this, um, if I simply click where the threads are going to be placed, you'll notice that it gives me a thread type, uh, ANSI or ANSI thread type, uh, size 0.216 or number 12 and then the designation 12-24 UNC, class type 2A, and it's a right-hand thread. That is the type of thread that we want. If we wanted to choose a different type, we could certainly click on the size 
menu and toggle on the size that we want to uh, apply to the screw, but we want the number 12. And again, we can do the same thing with the designation, toggling on a different uh, designation. But we should have uh, .216 or number 12 size and the designation 12-24 USC. Once you've done that, select Apply. And uh, next we want to choose the material type for this screw. So up here where it says generic, we want to go up to or go down to uh, mild steel or steel mild. Click on steel mild and save this as the knob socket head, head cap screw. Knob socket head cap screw. Save it in your trammel toy folder. Okay, next we're going to complete the arm socket head cap screw. And to do this, all we need to do is make a small edit to the uh, knob socket head cap screw. So I've got the knob socket head cap screw still loaded. And uh, I'm going to go over here to where it says extrusion 1 and reveal my sketches. Uh, if I go up to revolution 1, there's my sketch 1. That's what I want. So over here in my browser, You'll have to click on Revolution 1 to reveal your Sketch 1. Right click on Sketch 1, edit the sketch. Now the only thing that we, the only difference we have between the knob socket head cap screw and the arm socket head cap screw is the overall length, how tall it is. Okay, and the difference is that we want to change this 0.841 height to uh, 0.966. So I'm going to double click on this. And I want to change this to 0.966. So I type in 0.966 and click on the green check mark, finish the sketch. And we want to save this as the arm socket head cap screw. Arm socket head cap screw in your trammel toy folder. Okay, the last screw that we want to draw is the base socket head cap screw. And to do that, again, we're going to make some small edits to this uh, arm socket head, head cap screw that we have up here right now. Uh, so what I want to do is go over to Sketch 1. I'm going to right-click on Sketch 1 and select Edit Sketch. And uh, notice right now that the height of the screw is 0.966. I'm going to double-click on that. I'm going to change that to uh, point, uh, 1.25. So I'm going to change it to 1.25 and click on my green check mark. And next, I'm going to change the height of the head of the screw. So right now, the head of the screw is 0.216. So I'm going to double click on that and change that to 0.25. The diameter of the screw is fine. We don't need to do anything to that. We're going to select Finish Sketch. Okay, and the next thing we need to do is change the thread type. Okay, with this particular screw, the threads don't run entirely from the bottom of the screw all the way to the head of the screw. So we're going to go over here to Thread 1 in our uh, browser. Right click on Thread 1 in the browser and select Edit Feature. Um, we want to toggle off the full length for the thread length, and we want to specify the length of the thread. We want the threads to be 0.75 inches, and select OK. So 0.75 for the length, and OK. And now we've completed the, uh, the screw for the base socket head cap screw part file. So what we want to do is save this in our trammel toy folder as base socket head cap screw. Now this should conclude all of your screw part files for the trammel toy drawing.